Hey guys, it's your girl Tash and I am here again with yet another tutorial on how to corn twist with just natural hair. To all my subscribers, big up in yourself, one love. I created the corn twist as a kamikaze twist lookalike. So instead of twisting the hair at the root like the kamikaze twist, I can roll the hair at the root instead which helps the hair to grow faster and to prevent the use of excessive gel and straighteners which can later cause heat damages to your hair. So the corn twist consists of two styles of braiding which is the corn row and the two strand twist styles of braiding. So I am combining the corn row and the two strand twist style of braiding to create the corn twist which is the perfect kamikaze twist lookalike and it's a great protective style for the health and wellness of your afro hair texture. So my technique is to always section the hair from the center of the head so that I can achieve three equal rows on both sides. So as some of you might know, when it comes to creating the kamikaze twist, it's almost impossible to do it on afro kinky hair without straightening the hair and using excessive gel to hold that down on the root and it looks nice at first but later on when it start to sweat and your afro hair goes back to its original texture that twist is not gonna look so nice down on the root or it might not stay so firm down on the root anymore but with the corn rows, this will definitely stay down on the root much much nicer and we are avoiding using too much gel just to try and hold that twist down on the root so for me this is a more healthier and better option for guys with very kinky hair because although it looks nice when you straighten your hair it looks sleek and nice and all of that trust me in the long run you're gonna end up with a lot of split ends and a lot of breakage so it's up to you if you want to have a nice hairstyle and healthier hair in the long run or you just want to go and just do whatever you want to your hair that looks sleek and is trending and whatever and then later on your hair is breaking but i would definitely recommend this option for you guys first i'll need to corn row each row vertically and each row has to have an even amount of corn rows as they will be paired up when making the two strand twists on the ends. So I am going to corn row each row as if I am creating the fishbone hairstyle and as I said before make sure that you have an even number of corn rows so that they can be paired up for the two strand twists after on the ends. Guys, please note that you don't have to corn row everything vertically in a straight line. You can also use other symmetrical lines and get more creative with this look. Please check out my Instagram, Facebook and TikTok to see more creative patterns on this method. Please also check out my website, speechlesshairstyles.co.uk to find out more about the benefits of corn twist and why it's a better option as to the kamikaze twist. Please continue to watch as I demonstrate how to achieve this hairstyle. And guys, this client here is seven inches long. So if you would like to achieve something quite similar to this, you would need at least six to seven inches length of hair to achieve this. 